Hey, what is up YouTube? This is Ninja Lamb and today I'm bringing you guys a tutorial. I hope I can help you guys with this tutorial and also thank you for tuning in today for this tutorial. Well, that being said, we can get going with the tutorial but before that I would like to say please subscribe to the channel guys, show some support, I would really appreciate that and also if you could get 100 likes for this video or for my effort i would really appreciate that well that's out of the way now let's get going with the tutorial now i wanted to show you guys the easiest way and the simplest way to edit a video if you guys don't want to spend that much money on editing softwares and everything i know you can go to torrent and download those softwares and everything like that sometimes you get really bad viruses yep we all know that and even i have been there too so we have this elgato game capture hd we are in edit option right now the settings i have on this is i have um, enable flashback recording the reason why i have that because if you don't have that option selected the way i'm scrolling in right now as far as i know and the thing i have experienced with this it would not let you do this so if you wanted to do this right here like just keep flashback uh, recording i know it consumes a lot of um, storage even if you're not playing the game it will keep recording for you but um, I mean I would recommend that so that way so what we're gonna do here um, we're just gonna go scroll through here and I we just wanted to make sure that we have a perfect gameplay sometimes when you see those uh, professional gameplays and everything you're like man he's playing so nice he didn't even die at all well yeah he died somewhere probably i mean yeah sometimes they don't die at all but yeah they they do die trust me guys because um let's see here well i was enjoying the view right there so we're gonna go through this and we're gonna make sure that we don't die anywhere and if we are dying we just want to delete that part and make it a seamless um video going through so that way it looks nice and perfect let's see where to where are we going with this and want to scroll more let's see here da, 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 da. i remember it i oh right here so i paused the game right here so what we're gonna do we're gonna try to delete that pause let's see where does the pause comes in keep going okay right there so we're gonna hit the scissors right here we're gonna scroll right here let's keep going and let's see oh we're back already so we're gonna keep going back 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 come on how long did I pause it for? Okay, right there. So we're just gonna scroll nice and slowly to make sure. Right there, it goes, it goes out. And we're just gonna hit the scissors again. And then as soon as you click this middle part and hit delete on the keyboard, it's gonna merge the file for you. And when we play this video, I hope it plays it well for you guys. Uh, let me close this, all these things out. So that way it works good let's play it i mean you guys can see i hope it played well for you guys because i'm not sure if it's working for you or not but you can see that it was kind of seamless but kind of not so we'll go a little bit further down to make sure we didn't die anywhere else yeah the black screen all right so after that you have done what you wanted to do is you want to create a thumbnail for your youtube video what you can do you can scroll down through some really interesting 
Uh, it's blurry, blurry. Okay, this looks nice. We wanted to make sure there is no subtitles coming in the way. So right there is so perfect. What we're gonna do, we're gonna click right here on the camera. As soon as we click here, what we're gonna get is a thumbnail right there. I already had one. Why did I do it? But um, there it is right there, guys. And what you can do now, if you have, if you're happy with this, if you're happy with this, uh, what do you say it? The editing you have done, what you can do is you can click on this eye and then you can change this to the name you want it to do and shot it for a thieves why did I do that thieves and part one I don't know what part it was but I'm just gonna do part one for a sake of a video here just gonna click on the eye here it has already saved that for you what you can do is you can click right here file mp4 when you click that it will start loading for you as soon as I click it you can see it's it starts processing the video I'm just gonna click um, uh, cancel where can I cancel cancel okay I'm just gonna cancel it because I already have it um, done and ready to go but we're gonna continue with this thumbnail right here how to create that where for that we're gonna jump into Photoshop yep I mean you guys know Photoshop works the best we're gonna do file open we're gonna go to desktop because that's where we had it we're gonna click right here this was the thumbnail without the subtitles you can see there is subtitles right here this one doesn't have it we're gonna open it as you can see less of editing but I'll show you open that one too. this one right here this one has subtitles oh no well no way we're just gonna go right here spot healing brush we're gonna start healing this just don't worry about small details because nobody's gonna see in that small freaking thumbnail okay guys so just stop yeah don't even worry about it and after we have that i'm just gonna freaking hit cancel hit no all right so we have it right here what we're gonna do we're gonna hit t on the keyboard we have the text we're gonna put part one and then don't hit enter man don't hit enter because that color is gonna come down just click on this layer one right here and the text will stop right there we're gonna hit V and then we can move the text and when we move the text make sure you can place it wherever you like right on our face if you want to but I wouldn't recommend that um, we'll just put it right here and the white looks good on the black background we're just gonna double click on the layer there goes the layer style we're gonna add a stroke just to make it a little bit interesting we're gonna add a good color uh, blue you cannot even see that thing let's just go with red we're gonna click OK we're gonna increase the size of this stroke so it looks a little bit good that's too much Ooh, right there that looks a little bit better and there you have it guys right there we're gonna do control s for saving this file we're gonna do part one for that please make sure guys always save your file in Photoshop just in case if you mess up anything you can always come back open up that Photoshop file and fix whatever you need to and save that as a JPEG so we're gonna do that save as a Photoshop file we're gonna click that OK now we have saved that as a part one we're the the next thing we're gonna do is really easy Control shift s Control shift s and then we're gonna change this save as type to jpeg there is two jpeg guys please make sure always select the first one not with the 2000 because it won't work i don't know why but it won't work and we have already named the photoshop file as part one so this one already has the name so you don't have to do double work you don't have to type it in we're gonna click save always make sure keep it at a lower file size just to be on a safe side because YouTube doesn't allow you to upload really high quality thumbnails or bigger file I mean high quality thumbnails but no bigger file size so I mean if we go to maximum you can see it stays at 256 kilobytes and if we go to high it still says at 160 but I would not risk it I'll just go with medium and click OK it saved it we're gonna minimize it 
it's right here we're just gonna double click on it and you can see it's nice high quality it looks professional it's look it looks good so you can upload this on a YouTube so it works and this is the easiest way also the free way I know Photoshop cost but there is you guys know I mean I don't even have to tell you guys just be safe when you guys are doing that I wouldn't recommend it because if you guys don't have really good antivirus then it's gonna mess up your really good computer or only the computer you guys have so hopefully you guys enjoyed this tutorial um, I hope I can help you guys with tu this tutorial and please subscribe to the channel stay tuned I will be bringing you guys another tutorial um, how you can do it on Sony Vegas so please stay tuned for that and I'll see you guys next time all right stay happy and be nice to other people guys please be nice all right uh, I'll see you guys next time all right peace out bye